website. In this video, we're going to talk about the most important thing whenever you're making an affiliate website with WordPress. So you're going to want to stay tuned. Hello everyone, I'm Sean with SEO Sorcerer. If you've been here before, welcome back. If not, thanks for joining me. If you could do me a big favor, go ahead and subscribe, give me a big thumbs up, and ring that bell. It'd be greatly appreciated. All right, in this video, we're gonna talk about pillar content. What is pillar content? Pillar content is one of the most important things on your affiliate website. These are actually the category pages that you make whenever you're d designing your WordPress page. You're gonna turn your category pages into a weapon. It's not just gonna be a page that lists all the articles or all the blog posts in that category. It's gonna be something you're gonna use and it's gonna be a big ranking factor, factor for your website. So how are we gonna make our pillar page? Well, you're gonna do a, at least a thousand word content on each one. Ideally, you're gonna have four categories for your website. So say you're making a blog about coffee, coffee makers, coffee beans, best ways to make coffee, best coffee shops. The most four important things. These are things that are gonna be hard to rank for. So don't worry about how hard these four categories, these four categories are to rank for because we're going to figure that out down the road. Um, eventually you're going to rank for that, but that's going to be a long-term goal. In the meantime, don't worry about how hard it is to rank. What these pages are going to do, they're going to have at least a thousand words of content and they're going to link to each page that's in that category. So why are these pages so important? Because this is going to be what draws links to your page. This is what people are going to get the most value from. You need to put the time necessary to make sure the content is great. So you're going to put a lot of time into writing this content. You know, whether you want to outsource it, if you're going to outsource it, you want to pay top dollar to get this content. This is not going to be go pay someone $10 on Fiverr to get the content for the pillar content. You're going to want to, you know, spend, you know, probably $100 or more on this article. And if you want to do it yourself, that's definitely an option. Put the time necessary in. So how good do you want this content to be? Uh, take a look at some other websites that are near the top of the search results for what you're looking for. You know, you want this, this pillar content is going to be a resource for the people that are in, in your niche that are looking for this type of information. You know, it's not something you're just going to type and type and type until you get a thousand words. You want to answer every question someone's going to have. Like if you're talking about coffee makers, uh, you know, you want to address every type of coffee maker there is. Uh, you want to help the person find the best solution for the problem they're trying to solve. So like I said, you're gonna, these are going to be your category pages. Uh, you're going to have a lot of information and you're either going to link organically from this and if you're not able to, you're going to put a link, a list of links at the bottom. But ideally, uh, anytime you add a new blog post, that's an opportunity to add more length to your pillar page so you can link organically to your new blog post. All right, like I said, the reason why this is the most important is because it's going to be what brings backlinks to your website. People, this needs to be so good that when viewers see it, they want to link to it from their blog. They want to share it on social media. This is the crown jewel of your blog. All right, because in my last video, I referenced pillar pages, pillar content. That's why I made this video. You know, I wanted to make sure it wasn't something we just gloss over. So this is not a part of the uh, affiliate website series. This is just a quick video where I just drive home how important it is to build great pillar content. I'm going to put a link in the description with an article where it goes a little more in depth about the pillar content, so make sure you check that out. Don't take this lightly. It's so important to create great pillar content. All right, and thank you for checking out this video. Again, I'm Sean with SEO Sourcer. If you like this video, go ahead and give me a big thumbs up and subscribe if you want to see more content like this. Thanks for stopping by.